Netizens didn't like the recent statement of PNP Chief Police General Rodolfo Osorin Jr. not to scare the criminals and give them a second chance. The PNP leadership statement, according to the netizen, has resulted in an increase in kidnapping cases around the nation. If the PNP top cap is unwilling to change his style, they call for his resignation. A further claim made by the Volunteers Against Crime and Corruption is that General Azurin is not a pro-victim. Hindi sa pro-victim kamukha namin. Ano? Uh, kami ba nabigyan ng second chance yung mahal namin sa buhay? One is certain, ang mahal namin sa buhay is six feet below the ground while itong mga kriminal na to, eh, na-enjoy lahat nila yung benefits. Uh, the right to get a lawyer, the right to file motion for reconsideration. General Azrin meanwhile reputed the allegation. Uh, siguro uh, magkakaiba lang po kami ng, ng pananaw. Ano? Uh, sabi nga natin is uh, everybody deserves a second chance. Diba? Nasa Bible nga yan. Eh, diba? Ang ano lang dyan is siyempre sinasabi ko nga is mahirap kasi na palalabasin natin na lumalaban sila kung hindi naman sila lumalaban. Azrin also appealed to give them a chance to handle the peace and order in the country. Sa totoo lang, in the past, even when I was with Pao Kye, sa dami na nang namatay, sa dami na nang pinatay, bakit meron pa rin krimen? Yun ba ay solusyon? Diba? Bakit, bakit hindi silang gumawa niyan? Kung ano, diba? Ibig sabihin, there must be a better way to do things and doing our job right is one of the best things na kailangan ay may pakita natin so that manumbalik yung tiwala ng uh, According to the PNP anti-kidnapping group's track record, there are more kidnapping cases involving Pogo now than there were last year. The said data is apart from the series of abduction posted in social media where the victims were later found dead. Leia Ilagan, UNTV News and Rescue. We serve the people. We give glory to God.